Winchester PDX1 Defender and 45 Auto 230 grain bonded jacketed hollow point. I finally got around to testing it. Everybody's been asking me to test this round. Well, we're going to test it today. And we're going to test it in my Kimber Raptor. Four layers of denim, calibrated gel. Let's check it out, guys. Okay, guys, here we go with that 45 automatic PDX1 Winchester 230 grain bonded jacketed hollow point. I'm going to put it through four layers of denim, some calibrated gel. Let's check it out, guys. Let's go check it out. Okay guys, you can see where that 230 grain PDX1 went in. Instantly started dumping denim. Looks like it started opening up right at the three quarter mark. And then it tracks on down. Looks like a pretty good wound channel there. We're gonna get that side view cut open here. But it looks like it's gonna go about right to nine inches. You keep on going down, tracking down. We're tracking down flat lines on us. And it looks like there it is down in the gel. Right at, looks like leading edge, 18 and a quarter. PDX1 Defender 45 Auto 230 grain bonded jacketed hollow point. Let me get that up out of there so you guys can take a look and we'll get that side view for you. Okay guys, I got that PDX1 up out of the gel for you. You can see right there, expansion looks awesome. I don't see anything broken off. I didn't see anything down in the track. We'll get that side view here in a second. I think weight retention is going to be spot on. As you guys can see right there, bonded bullet <laughs> sporting a nickel jacket right there, or nickel case. Let me get that side view. We'll get weights and measurements and post. Okay guys, here we are at the Winchester PDX1 Defender 45 Auto 230 grain bonded side view. As you guys can see, that thing instantly started opening up. As Soon as it went in, it started expanding. And it dumped right at one inch, as you guys see that. Dumped, probably about two inches. You can see the rotation as it's going in. Continues to dump. Still got denim all the way down at the four and a half to five. It looks like it starts to settle down a little bit right around six and a half but we still got a channel going and then it finally flatlines around nine winchester pdx1 defender 45 auto 230 grain awesome result guys awesome result get weight and measurements and post for you okay guys another little look at here we're at the post of the winchester pdx1 defender 45 auto 230 grain bonded jacketed hollow point you guys seen the results today pretty damn good results pretty damn good Fired out of the Kimber Raptor, five inch barrel, through four layers of denim into calibrated ballistics gel. Here's the results, guys. One in about three quarters of an inch, rapid expansion. We had a pretty damn good wound track all the way down to about nine inches. And then it went ahead and streamlined down. We went all the way to 18 and a quarter penetration. Pretty deep penetration, pretty heavy bullet. Humming along, singing a song, they got this thing rated at 920 feet per second. Muzzle energy, 432. It's a lot of lead to be hitting you, I'll tell you what, 230 grains of it. Weight retention, exact, 230. Of course, I'll throw that up there like I always do for you guys. Max expansion on this bad boy, 765 at its widest point. Pretty awesome. That thing is just way back. Look at the talons. You guys will see those in the close-ups. The average, 703. Of course, I'll throw all that up there so you guys can see that too. PDX1, damn good round. Testing these, these, these are you know out there. You guys can find these even with the ammo crunch. You guys can still find these. 230 grain, it's an awesome round. 45, the typical 45 bad boy, 230 grain. Hollow points are pretty deep on these things. I'll try to get a close up of that down in there, get a measurement or something from you. It's got the nickel case, feeds really good. It's not a real, real wide hollow point, but it goes does go down in there deep. Expands pretty damn well as you guys can see right here. It expanded great uh, Once again Winchester PDX1. It's all over the place guys pick up some damn good rounds They feed perfect everything like that if you're looking for these online uh, Product number is s45 PDB Once again 920 on the velocity muzzle energy 432 Kicking some ass today guys kicking some ass you guys seen the side cut of that Pretty deep penetration, 18 and a quarter, pretty heavy bullet. It's humming along singing a song. It's not even plus P rated, and they've got this thing at 920. So, once again, guys, awesome round. Go find some. Well worth it. Will it stop the threat? 
I'd say it would. Because I sure as hell don't want to get hit by that. You guys have a good one, man.